One day, Maria and Bobby had just finished shunting in the yard when Mr. Wilbert arrived. You two have done a great job today. As a reward, you two can have the rest of the day off. Oh, thank you, sir. That is just what we need. When Mr. Wilbert left, Maria and Bobby decide to rest in the sheds. You know, Maria, what we need now is a story. Oh, yes, let's tell a magical story. Did someone say magical story? I love those. Then you're in for a treat. I'll tell you both a story about a magical railway. And this was the story that Bobby told. They say on the island of Sodor, there is a magical railway, and on that railway lives a magical engine. This engine is able to travel to Sodor by going through magic buffers. And that's all I know so far. It's short, but a very sweet story. Is that a true story, Bobby? It can't be true. How can an engine travel to another railway by going through some buffers? Magic can do all sorts of things, but it can't do that. Well, it might be true. The island of Sodor is full of surprises. Where did you hear that story from, Bobby? I heard it from a pair of diesels who work on Sodor from time to time. <laughs> you can't believe some story that two random diesels told you. Then let's find out the truth. I know a pair of buffers hadn't been used for a long time. So Bobby took Maria and Shira to some old buffers. Bobby, don't do this. I have to, Maria. I have to see if this will work. Well, wish me luck. With no surprises, Bobby had smashed through the buffers and laid on his side. Bobby, are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. So those buffers weren't magical after all. Maybe they only exist on Sodor. Maria rolled her eyes, and Shira just chuckled. <laughs> <laughs>